Hi Dave, Katrina here from the TrackX team. Thanks very much for your um, post on the forum and also for your kind words. Um, in this short video, I'm just gonna show you a couple of the tools that you could use to try and reduce some of the background noise that's on your teleconference um, mix that you're trying to create. So the first thing I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna create a loop region and this will just allow me to be able to loop the area while I'm testing the different effects just to like get um get the levels I'm happy with rather than having to play the whole thing continuously and I'm just gonna have the loop functionality set to on. So then if I right click on the track segment there I can go to audio effects and I'm gonna use the blue cat triple equalizer. So I'm just gonna drag this out for part of it and because I'd like this all to be at the same level throughout the whole video I'm going to I can either bring up the effect levels to 100% or I can actually just get rid of one of those nodes so it's just a straight line. So I'm just going to pull this back here and I'll just play back a section hopefully you can hear some of the recorded audio that I have and it's just me uh, reading a narration. If you were like me, with thousands of photos and, images, and then we go into the effect. So what you can do is you can just have this playing pull up your effect properties and then play around with the properties here till you're happy so if I bring this down here and I'm going to drag this down here too and hopefully you can hear the difference there so you can just play around with these levels depending on your recording and see how it sounds and so then we're back to so that sounds a lot better. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of this loop region. I'm going to bring my effect all the way to the start. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. And then I can add this effect to the, the whole track. And I obviously can minimize that effect there if I want to see some of the the other options so this may affect the volume somewhat so you can increase the volume here if it's getting slightly low and then you're good to go to either export it or start building it up with other pieces of media that you need to use i hope this video helps and if you require any further information at all please feel free to drop me a line many thanks